Hey, what's up, you guys? It is me, Stephanie Chanel. Welcome back to my channel. Well, today, you guys, I am going to be showing you all um, a few fragrances that are dumb affordable and they last a really, really long time. So let's go ahead and get started with my number one fragrance right here. This is probably my favorite fragrance. Uh, this is Guest by Marciano, okay? So here we are, Guest by Marciano. This is just a really beautiful fragrance. This has caracal, cardamom, um, among other things. Man, I don't know all the notes in this, but this is just super beautiful. This is actually a fragrance that I believe would probably go well all year round. And on the skin, I easily get about four and a half, five hours. Now that's good for some people. Other people think that that's not great. But for me, it's beautiful. And for the price point, um, I mean, say less. I, I don't have a problem spraying this, like re touching up on this. Um, but I paid about $25 for the full gift set. And that is just an amazing fragrance, you guys. Um, so that is number one. Second fragrance, I lost the top, but this is Delicious Cotton Candy by Gail Heyman. And as you can see, this is this one gets used, okay? We use her up, okay? So this is basically just like pink sugar, okay? This is this is pink sugar. To me, this is pink sugar without the licorice note. I do believe this does have a licorice note, but I don't get it in this. Um, this is more like a fresher, sweet, kind of florally fragrance, fruity. It's very pretty. I love it. And this on my skin, you guys, I easily get about five and a half, six hours with this. On my skin, on my clothes, I do smell it. Um, I do smell it. The next day um, on my clothes but definitely on my skin it lasts me about five and a half six hours I love that fragrance it's so good and it's super sugary and sweet I was skeptical to show you guys because I don't have the original bottle I decanted it into this um, inside of this bottle I actually have um, Italiano Donna from Armoff and that's why the juice is yellow and not pink. So sorry for like the misconception, but this is not Ari. This is Italiano Donna by Armoff. And if you're not familiar with that, it's just another marshmallowy, sweet, beautiful fragrance. It's very similar, if not supposed to be a dupe um, of Dolce Cabana's Pour Femme. Um, I love this fragrance. It is so good. It's super sweet. On me, that easily lasts me about five and a half, six hours. Again, it's so beautiful. On clothing, I smell it the next day. Um, it's not like, none of these are beast mode to where they make like this huge bubble around you all day long. A lot of these do tend to become skin scents after a while, but they still are lasting on you. And when you walk past somebody, they will get a whiff of your perfume. So it's still really good. Um, and I love it. So yeah, Italiano Donna by Armoff. Next. Okay. Let's talk about, is, have I told you guys prices? I don't think I've told you prices except for the first one. So hold up. Wait a minute. Price point. I paid like maybe, I paid about $15 for this fragrance. Um, I didn't pay much at all for this. This is very inexpensive. I got mine from Fragrance Net. Italiano Donna, I got that off of Fragrance Net as well. And I'm not really sure how much I paid for it. I got it a couple of years ago. Um, but I know that it wasn't over 20 bucks. So none of these fragrances, honestly, were over, let's just say at least 30 bucks. All of these are under $30. Jimmy Choo's Illicit. Okay. I had to go and get her because why would I make a video about Fragrances that will last you all day and not bring her. So sorry about this. Mine came with this on it. It was a tester bottle, actually, um, which is why I think my juice is so much darker right now. But the fragrance is still really good. Oh, my goodness, you guys. So this is honey ginger. You definitely get that ginger. Oh, my God. I don't know what else is in this, but this is just like a honey bomb to me. This fragrance just dries down to be very honey, very 
musky hint of floral there might even be some burk not bergamot but like a mandarin kind of uh scent in there something citrus but not like fresh citrus if that makes any sense this is just such a beautiful scent, you guys. I 110% love that fragrance. This will last you all day long. Trust me. I love Jimmy Choo Illicit. I have no problems with the longevity of this fragrance. It is fire. This thing is so good. And the dry down is, whoo, I love that. So anyway, let's move on now. Next, we have um, Mariah Carey's M. So funny thing about this fragrance when I first bought this it was clear and I was very mad because I used to see everybody on um YouTube with their deep dark juice and I'm like hey I want my juice to look like that and so when I got the clear juice I honestly thought this was fake but I found out that they reformulated it so the very first one I guess did come with like brown juice um but now it comes with a clear juice I don't know but anyways Mine is starting to deepen up. And this is just what happens with perfumes that hold vanilla and things like that. Inside of it, it starts to oxidize. So that's what's happening with this one. Anyway, this is M by Mariah Carey. This is such a good fragrance, you guys. This is incense, marshmallow, sea notes. Mm, this is just so good. It's a hint smoky. It's very sweet, very marshmallow. This is deliciousness guys go crazy over this fragrance it lasts you all day it's a very mature scent to be a celebrity fragrance but i absolutely love it and this one is literally like 20 bucks at burlington um so if you ever see this i would suggest getting your hands on it and you guys if you leave it in your closet for a couple of weeks maybe even a month and the juice starts to turn like this it's like the fragrance gets better um this one is so good, you guys. Like, I love this fragrance. I love this fragrance a lot. I definitely definitely suggest it. And um, it's just a really, really good celebrity fragrance. Okay, so the last fragrance is going to be Golden Decade. And this is by Zara. And this is supposed to be um, a dupe. Or people have said this is a dupe for YSL Lieb Intense. To me, this is a bit better because that amber in here is just something new. It's something different. It's something beautiful. Mm, but this is so good, you guys. Like, I love... Okay. So, anyways, this one is so good, you guys. It's super... Let me not say super sweet. But it's on the sweeter end. It is... Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, my gosh. Mm, that amber is doing something to me now. It's weird because to my nose, I get something gingery. And I don't think that there's anything with ginger in this, but this is something in this that's coming off a little spicy to me that in my nose is ringing as ginger. But this is so good, you guys. It's orange blossom. I believe there's vanilla. There's amber. It's so, so, so good, you guys. And it's such a beautiful fragrance. And this lasts all day long i don't know what zara did but these fragrances in these bottles are amazing okay i only own uh two other fragrances from zara and they do not compare to this 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 is like money this looks like money like just look at this bottle this looks like money this smells like money it is so good you guys i wish you could smell it i wish you could smell this it's so good so this is um, Golden Decade by Zara. This is honestly, um, I think it cost me 20 bucks, 21 bucks, something like that. It was very affordable, extremely inexpensive. And so, yeah, you guys, that is, I believe that's it. Is that it? Is that it? That's all, you guys. Those are all the fragrances that I believe are not beast mode but they do last you for a really long time and they will have you smelling like a baddie on a budget okay all of these fragrances are definitely pretty girl fragrances they are fragrances that i believe every frag head or fragrance lover should at least try if not keeping them in your collection at least try them because they're so 
so so good you guys and you will definitely not be disappointed in any of them um i love them and of course they're inexpensive so they're not breaking the bank either so you guys that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give it a big thumbs up go ahead and drop your comments down below let me know what your scent of the day is and also let me know what kind of uh videos you guys are interested in seeing that way i can bring those out for you guys so i love you all so much and i'll see you in another one Peace.